we're just slowly going through our integration piece by piece by piece because you know it's important that we get that right otherwise we'll all think that Sebastian is the failure and actually it's those interfaces. We know Sebastian works, we know she's comfortable, we just have to make the rest of the system that supports us work in tandem. So this is the first time we've had access to the full umbilical cable. So we've tested with a short length and the Ambari tank testing for about 250 metres, but now we've got five and a half kilometres of cable on the winch just outside. It's like a multi-purpose lifeline from the vehicle to the ship. We use it as a strength member when we're lowering the vehicle into the water and picking it out of the water with the winch. It also brings communications and power. The challenge for us is taking it working from on the bench to working with a couple of hundred metres in between the control room and here, and then working with a couple of thousand metres between here and the bottom of the ocean. It's very exciting to have Sebastian finally with us. Um, there's been a lot of planning and discussions over the past year or so, and we've had some input, of course, from the ship side. It's just very good to be able to see it finally here, to see our ideas and our contributions uh, incorporated into the vehicle. You know, we're about to put the vehicle off Falker in the water for the first time, and that's pretty exciting. We want to test as much as we can and, and go through everything as much as possible because we only have two weeks to get new parts made or, or built so that we can move on and go to the next step. Uh, we're at a position where we've got Sebastian now fully running so we know that integration of machinery van onto the ship, um, the integration of the ship's power into that machinery van and then the power distribution unit through the winch, the slip ring and the umbilical all the way down to Sebastian is now complete, you know, we pretty much are very comfortable that we can control that part, but we still have to dive this vehicle, you know, and that's going to be tough, you know. Yeah, I think to some extent this is the moment a lot of us have been waiting for, so um, the satisfaction for us comes from seeing it all come together and start working, so it will be great to see it in the ocean proper, and like actually having it in the Pacific Ocean, salt water.